Hi, today I want to talk about the ESP32 and do some follow-up to my last video where I discuss an Eddystone beacon and today I want to do the opposite side, the beacon scanner on the ESP32 so we can see what if we have few different beacons and how they interact together with some central station. So let's just jump into the Arduino code and this is derived from an example from Neil Colburn, just a BLE scan example and I have changed it to fit to my needs. So we start by the setup routine, we initialize the monitoring, then initialize the Bluetooth device, prepare the scanning and then we setting up the callback routines and set the active scan to true so we have a faster result. And in the loop, we just start the scanning, wait for the results printed out in the callback routine, and then we wait for five seconds and start again. So let's look into the callback routine. The callback routine have an on result method, and then this is all we need to configure. And in the method, we just print out the found device and then get the service data and we decide what type of device we found. So maybe we have a special UUID so we can decide this is an Eddystone beacon or we have to look deeper into the manufacture data so we can decide okay this is an iBeacon or we have some other device so we can print out some data or we have no beacon at all maybe some other Bluetooth low energy device. So let's have a deeper look into the Eddystone data. I've written some some classes so we can deeper get the data of the Eddystone beacons. But first we have to decide is this the URL type Eddystone beacon or the TLM Eddystone beacon data or we have some other data so we can just print out the raw service data. But if we have an URL then we can decode the URL and print it out or we have a TLM then we can print some general data like the temperature, the voltage and so on. And if we have an iBeacon discovered then we can print out the iBeacon data and that's it. And here are my bench setup for today. We have one beacon scanner as an ESP32 and one, two, three, four, five other beacons as Eddystone, different frame types and also iBeacons. And they are all powered with my power bank and also an ST-Link version 2 3.3 volt regulator inside. And here we see the scan results in the Arduino serial monitor and we see that we found five devices and they presented as an Eddystone TLM frame beacon and also we have an Eddystone URL frame type beacon and also we can see the different iBeacons that are transmitting their frame count. And the scanning is repeated over and over again. So thanks for watching today. I hope you find this useful and you learned something today. So all the source codes you find in the description. Please share, like and subscribe to my channel and write some comments if you have some questions or some suggestions for this small little prototype. Thanks for clicking today. See you next time and bye bye.